Hello, today's video we have the following content. The Storm Chaser mysteriously changed its name, Wang Yibo and Linkage status became a mystery, and the spy war is back on the rise. There are endless new dramas in the film and television industry. Zhao Liying's Walking with the Phoenix has just started the craze, and Wang Yibo's new drama The Wind and Waves is about to be released. However, just before it was scheduled to be released, this drama, which has always been extremely low-key, suddenly announced that it would be renamed Storm Chaser, which aroused the curiosity and speculation of countless fans and viewers. Storm Chaser has maintained a veil of mystery since it started filming. There was no high-profile publicity between the launch and completion of filming, making people curious about the story behind it. Now, with the announcement of the scheduled schedule, the mysterious part of this drama has finally been revealed. It is reported that the play is directed by the talented director Yao Ziyata Fen, with Wen Myangping as the screenwriter, starring Wang Yibo, Li Qin, Wang Yang, etc., and veteran actors such as Wang Zuki have joined the cast. This spy drama of the Republic of China tells the legendary story of Wei Rule played by Wang Yibo who grew from an ordinary bank employee to an outstanding red financier. However, just as the show released a new trailer, some attentive viewers discovered a problem. In the trailer, although there are many scenes of Wang Yibo, his condition seems not to be satisfactory. Puffy face, slumped appearance, too long midsection, translucent nose, these appearance problems appear extremely abrupt under the lens of period dramas. At the same time, the status of the heroine Lee Kin has also attracted attention. The loss of collagen makes her look slightly older, completely different from her previous image. In fact, it is understandable for celebrities to undergo appropriate medical aesthetic adjustments in order to look better on camera, but the key is not to affect their performance. The sequelae caused by excessive cosmetic surgery are irreversible. They will not only affect the stability of the actor's appearance, but also have a negative impact on the performance. This is also the reason why some celebrities sometimes look bloated and sometimes look rejuvenated. For the drama Storm Chaser, although the status of the actors has caused some controversy, we should still look forward to the drama itself. After all, a good work depends not only on the appearance of the actors, but also on its storyline and the performances of the actors. I hope Wang Yibo and Li King can make up for their shortcomings with their acting skills and present a wonderful spy drama to the audience. Of course, let us take a closer look at the leading actors in the show Storm Chasers and their glorious journey in the entertainment industry. Wang Yibo, as a new generation of powerful actor, has attracted much attention every step of his growth. From his initial role as a dancer to today's all-around artist in film, television, singing, and singing, his efforts and talents have been widely recognized by the industry. In The Storm Chaser, his role as Wei Ruole will gradually transform from an ordinary bank employee into an outstanding red financier. This is undoubtedly a new challenge for his acting skills. We hope that he can once again refresh the audience's understanding of him with this drama. The heroine Lee Kin is also a high-profile new star in the entertainment industry. She won the audience's love with her fresh and refined temperament and solid acting skills. In The Storm Chaser, she will join hands with Wang Yibo to interpret a spy war legend during the Republic of China. The Wind and Waves is set in Shanghai in the 1930s and tells a story of financial espionage. In the play, Wei Rule, played by Wang Yibo, was initially an ordinary employee of the Kuomintang Central Bank. With his outstanding work ability, he gradually gained the favor of senior advisor Shen Tunin, played by Wang Yang. In the process, Wei Rule also witnessed many corruption and dark sides in the Kuomintang's financial field. Later, he met Shen Tunin's sister and Communist Party member Shen Jinshen, played by Li Qin, and under the arrangement of the organization, he gradually became the backbone of the Chinese Communist Party's economic front. Although this drama has a strong main theme, it is not full of fighting and killing plots like other spy dramas. Instead, it is the scheming and struggle of different camps in the economic system, which is tense and exciting. It is worth mentioning that the drama Storm Chaser also brings together many veteran actors, among whom Wang Zuki's joining undoubtedly adds a lot to the drama. As a senior actor, Wang Zuki's acting skills have reached the level of proficiency, and every role he plays can leave a deep impression on the audience. In The Storm Chaser, he will star on the same stage with young actors such as Wang Yibo and Li Qin. I believe there will be different sparks. In addition, in the entertainment industry, various awards events are also a stage for stars to show their strength and honor. Both Wang Yibo and Li Qin have won important awards in multiple awards events. These honors are not only recognition of their past efforts, but also encouragement for their future development. 
We look forward to them being recognized with more honors for their outstanding performances. One Storm Chasers airs.